In this video, we will try to create an attractive article. You can click to the last chapters to see the video you missed. There are several techniques. We will start with format text. Let's go to Article Manager. Click on the article about my site to open it. Now focus on the article editor area. Take a close look at formatting options. Most of the icons look very familiar. Just select the text you want to give style. For example, here I want to make the welcome sentence larger. Click the drop-down menu, Paragraph. Choose a suitable heading. You can see the text is now larger. I want to list my products with bullets. I will edit it from one line to several lines. Select all the lines, then click to the bullet icon. So I made a list of my products. Make the important text bold, for example, luxury stuff. So we finished formatting text. Now we will add some images into the article. First, you should organize images in a certain folder. Go to Content, then click Media Manager. Input the folder name, such as About My Site, and then click the button Create Folder. Now you can upload the images into your newly created category. Then click on the button Browse or Choose File. Select the image file you want to upload. Right now, only a single file can be selected at a time. But later we will show you how to select multiple files. Click on the button Start Upload. Now your newly uploaded image is in the About My Site category. There's another method of uploading multiple files with Flash Uploader. Click on the button Options. Set the parameter and enable the Flash Uploader to Yes. Click Save and Close. You can see some changes with the buttons. Now you can click Browse Files to upload images. You can use your mouse cursor to mark all the files. Click on the button Start Upload and wait until the uploading process is complete. Now, when the images are uploaded to the server, it's time to add them to the article. Let's go back to the article. In the content area, put your cursor at the point you want to insert an image. For example, here, I will add an image under the list of products. Click the button Image below the article. Choose the appropriate image to insert. Then input parameters in the image description and image title describing the image. Click on the button Insert to finish the image insertion. I feel that the image is too big. I want to change its dimensions. Click on the image first, and then click on the button Insert Edit Image. Input the suitable width dimensions, 400. Click the Update button. The image is now smaller and it looks better, but I still want to change its alignment. Put it in the center, it will be more beautiful. So click to the Align Center button. It's fine now. Go to the site to see your new article with image. Here is my article with image in the site. You can also add as many images as you want. So we finish adding the image. Now we will continue to create internal links between the articles. For example, I will put the link in the first paragraph under the welcome sentence. Click the article button below the article editor. You will see a pop-up window with the list of all your articles. Find the article you want to link. You can also add link to a selected text. Click to Insert Edit Link button. Input the link URL you want to drive visitors to, then click Insert. Now click on the button Save and Close, and go to your site to see the article with the new link. Refresh the old page. You can see the article now has two links to other articles. In the case of having a long article, you will need to divide the article into separate sections. You have two options. You can put the text cursor to the position where you want to split the article. Click on the Page Break button. This element will divide the article into separate pages. Input the title you want to give to this page. Then click the Insert Page Break button. 
you will see a dotted line showing a page break inside your article. Click the button Save. View your site to see the result. It shows a list beside the article. You just need to click Next to enter the page, or you can click on the title of the page in the right corner. Please note that you can add as many page breaks as you want. The second option to split your article is adding the Read More link. This element divides a full single article into a teaser text and the rest of the article. For example here, I want the reader only to read up to the third products. Click on the button Read More under the article editor. Then you will see a dotted line in red, and then set the parameter featured to Yes. In this way, you make this article appear on the front end page. Click the button Save to finish. Here is your article with the Read More link at the front end. You just need to click on the button Read More to read the full article. So in this video, you can understand basically how to make your content look more attractive. Thank you for watching. In the next video, we will customize website appearance with Joomla template. You can keep in touch with us through Facebook and Twitter with the username Joomla Shine. The second type is a